Today I have a video on some insane glitches in Vanguard. In this, I am going to be showing you like four glitches. Actually, after you know this method, you're going to be able to do like 20 glitches. This way is just crazy. Shout out to the founders, which will be linked in the description. But anyways, that's it for that, man. And let's go right ahead and get this show on the road. Step one is to go right ahead and load up into Shinonuma round base on Vanguard. We're not going to be doing the other modes. We're going to Vanguard round base. Now, once you're in the map, go right ahead and kill the zombies and open up the map and you want to simply open up these doors so I can get to the spot now like I said there is pretty much like 20 different spots that you can do this at it is really easy to do this for other spots kind of obvious where they're at and you know I'm just gonna explain every little thing about this because some spots may not work so we're gonna go through tell you everything about this method and now with these glitches you really want an RPG now you don't need an RPG for some of these spots but you really want one because it's gonna be a lot harder to kill the zombies if you don't have one so get yourself the bazooka panzer shrek but once you get it you want to head all the way over to this location on the map this is basically where you get one of the parts for the wonder wolf and you're going to be heading all the way on top of this higher part so go up this slope then from this slope you're going to be doing a run jump on top of this railing type of thing now like i said there are multiple spots with this i'm going to explain everything watch till the end once you guys are on this railing you want to go right ahead and simply go prone inside of this post you want to go prone and make sure your head is in that post at this point you just want to sit here and what will happen eventually is the zombies are going to go to you and they're going to pile up around you now if you do not see zombies go to you and they're just running around shoot your gun that will attract their attention and they will go all around you and if you're inside of this post no zombies will be able to kill you which is op now basically that's the method you're gonna be getting inside of post and if you are inside of them or somewhat inside of them then you just won't get hit and as you can see they're just not hitting me and now what i'm gonna do right now is i'm just showing you that you can melee while you're in this so if you don't have that bazooka you can just melee but if you have that bazooka panzer shrek whatever you have you can use that and shoot it and that explosive damage will actually kill all the zombies around you now it is super easy to get into and like I said, you can do this around the whole map. There are a ton of places that you can do this at. And one other spot is all the way over here. Again, all you want to do is simply jump on top of the railing, then go over to this post, then go prone inside of it, just like the other one. And this one right here is really good as well. It's pretty much the same concept as the last one. And there are many, many different posts that you can do this at. Like I said, I'm going to keep stressing that point that there are a ton of other ones. And now once you are in these spots, do keep in mind that the explosive zombies will damage damage you if you shoot them that explosive damage will hit you and the actual like boss zombies do kill you as well so this is really only good for regular zombies this isn't the best glitch out there but for the fact that it's so easy to do it is really good because like it takes no skill no hardship to do this all you do is jump and get inside a post that's it and now there is another one all the way over at this location where the electric trap is you want to simply just again jump on top of the railing go all the way up to this top post go prone and that's it now with this one as you can see i'm going to be more to the right so you see that my character is not necessarily completely in the post but he is kind of in the post some of his body parts are in it and that right there will make the zombies pile up so you don't have to be fully in the post you can have some spots where you're not where you're you know slightly in it and they'll still pile up but definitely you want to make sure that you're in the post as much as possible now another thing is spots that don't work because some spots just don't work and the reason why they don't work is because the zombies will push you out of the post and completely just get you out of there so you get hit and here's a perfect example right here as you can see i'm on top of this railing right here i'm gonna go all the way over to this post that is sticking up really high and if i get into it with proning you will see that if the zombies go to me they're gonna push me out of the spot and then they're gonna hit me so you can't do it at that spot so keep that in mind when you're trying to look for different spots if you just get pushed out you will most likely not be able to do it and yeah that's really about it so hopefully you understand everything with this glitch and hopefully you enjoyed it i went through in depth like i said and you know go right ahead take advantage and just use this to get through waves just keep in mind the big boss guy i forgot the name of it but the one that teleports can kill you and i'm pretty sure the ones with the machine guns can damage you as well and those explosive can so it's only good for regular zombies that is really about it but it's still really cool since you can get in it really easily now i'm gonna go over and show you guys the best covenants i think that's what they're called i'm gonna show you guys the best ones to bring with this glitch so number one is this one i don't have the name of them on the 
screen with me but this one right here will actually make it so you constantly deal damage to the zombies when they are around you which is so cool to do because you can be having them piled up and it's always good to always damage them every single second and another massive positive about this is that if you get insta kills with you know being in this glitch because when you're in this glitch if the zombies drop power-ups or drop ammo clips your character will just automatically pick them up and basically with insta kills you're gonna be instantly killing the zombies all around you without shooting anything with this right here and that is really cool next one that i recommend is this one right here again i don't have the exact names on the screen right now so i don't know the names you guys will see the names but i don't see the names and this one right here just makes it so you deal more damage when you're standing still and this is perfect because you are literally going to be standing still, in fact kind of like proning still, and that will make it so your weapons do more damage, which is always a huge plus. Lastly is this one on the screen that makes it so you take less rocket launcher damage. Now this is really annoying to get. I could not get it in my game, but you know, if you get it, grab it. Because what's going to happen is it's going to make it so you can just kill more zombies faster since you're taking less damage. And those are the three things that are recommended. And the best thing know rocket launcher is definitely this one on the screen grab this one if you can this one is op but basically that is it for this video i went through exactly how to do this glitch exactly how to do this method exactly what class to bring so you guys should leave with no questions thank you for watching subscribe to join the silent squad but that's it peace